Well, I think it would be very important to make it a national holiday. And one of the main reasons is because one of the things we suffer from in our country <clears throat> is that we know so little of our own history. And the average person has no idea that slavery lasted in this country 256 years, 100 years before the country was even formed. They have no idea of the brutality of slavery. They have no idea what happened after slavery, the fact that people really weren't free. They were <clears throat> incarcerated and enslaved over and over again. And so Juneteenth, a national holiday, would be a time for us to come to grips with our history, to learn more about it. I think they would have a deeper understanding of the, the phrase Black Lives Matter, because for 256 years, and one could argue up until today, Black lives did not matter in this country. Well, you know, at some point in time, we just need to acknowledge that the president does not care about the American people. He obviously doesn't care about the 118,000 people who are dead, who have died in the last three months. He has yet to express a second of empathy. And so why would we be surprised that he thinks he discovered Juneteenth, that no one knows about it? Um, the ignorance that the president has displayed, not just about race, but about most things, even his job, at some point we have to say, this is who is the president of the United States and need to stop being surprised and need to focus on the election that is gonna take place in the next 140 plus days. For members of the administration to say, or even the president, there's no systemic problem. It's just a couple of bad apples. It is a negation of the history of this country, which is a great reason why Juneteenth needs to be a holiday.